Hello and good evening everyone! Welcome back to Logical Cogs Let's Play of Evil Land 2. So I've just got the back from watching Troy and drinking way too much than I should. So tonight should be pretty interesting for this uh, last episode I'll shoot until tomorrow morning. Anyway, since last time we've been exploring around the town, trying to see what's new in this particular timeline of Evil Land. We've just entered the library, so now let's let's explore, see what there is to find. All right. So, buddy, what do you have to say to us? Welcome to the Great Library of Genova. We catalog the most ancient texts to be closely studied. You're boring. Anything that's just no. Wow, this library seems a lot smaller than it was in the future, but oh well. Ah, you were interested in the history of the Empire? Not really. Did you know that after the Emperor was defeated, a strange, staggering number of demons appeared in Demonia as if by magic? This only served to prolong the war as many died in its wake. Well, I guess that was good to know. Not sure why, but whatever. You back there! What do you have to say about all this nonsense? The tale of Dalkin the Red makes my hair stand on end. Surely he was a fine colonel, but he also sacrificed his entire army in order to kill Mag Magus. Wasn't there a less violent way to do uh, go about it? Probably, but still. Yeah, killing your entire army to kill... I assume it was one guy? That's a bit, you know, extreme. Alright, hey, there's a chest back here. Let's see what's inside of it. After we talk to this boy, of course. I'm beginning to worry about dear Miss Yuli. I do hope she didn't encounter trouble while traveling to that pirate island. I really have more... I really ha I really have more important things to do than our... To do than chat with former stu students. I better not let them see me. Yeah, I was gonna say, she's at our party right now. If you don't recognize that she's like, you know, standing right behind us, you're pretty, you know... Dense. Alright, what's in this chest here? More mana! Sweet! So, by a process of elimination, Yuli, you get this one. Because you are special. Alright, well, that was a short library visit. I was kind of, kind of expecting, you know, more, but oh well. Alright, so we hit the library. Where to next? Oh yeah, there's the happy couple there. Hey guys, what's going on? Yeah, during the war you can still- Oh yeah, I already talked to you about how I visited the kingdom already and stuff, so... How about you? What's up? The Coliseum is closed. We don't have enough fighter. Z you missed the S there, buddy. Who would fight if they didn't have to? Come back later. Maybe some brave fighters will look for a challenge. Maybe. I don't know. Who, who who knows? What? You want to enter our secret base? First, you must bring me the five keys that prove you are one of us. We each keep close watch on, on a key so it won't be easy. Where the heck is my key? Dang it, I must have lost it when I was playing in that mine west of Genova. Oh, I already got that key. Goody for me. So we have three, so we need two more. The old Imperial Jail isn't in use anymore. All the demon prisoners were transferred to the mine. At least that make that make themselves useful there. The door is closed. Well, damn, I have three of the keys. Where do I get the last two? Where have I not visited yet? Well, it's... you were here before, kid. What's up? Ugh. I was playing with my key when a guard caught me. We were not really... We're not really allowed to have keys. So he took it, I'm pretty sure he stashed it away in one of the chests they have in have at the foot of their beds. But if I go into the guard room, they'll see me. Well, thank you for that bit of advice, kid. I'll sure to take your key and not give it back. <laughs> guard room, guard room, where be guard room? Was it the guard room or was it the shop? Nope, guard room. You got a key from the children. Okay, one more to go. Hey, buddy, what's up? There are some weird sounds inside. Maybe it was just some rats. 
Cool, so we got that key, but we still need one more. Now, where could that key be? Ugh. God, I'm feeling that alcohol hit me real good tonight. See, that was the library. We didn't see a key in there. Can I go behind this building? No. Hmm. Where could the last key be? Hmm. Black Dolls, do you hold the answer? That's right. He was there to give special ingredients to, which we don't have enough of. The store is closed. Since the war ended, my dad's... Oh, yeah, that's right. So we can't get inside of his house yet. You think I'm going to tell you where I hid my key? Ha ha, viewers. That's right, the mailman thing. Oh. That's... Okay, I get it. We just have to invade mailboxes. At least that's what I'm assuming right now. It may not be in the mailbox, but given that she said mailman, I'm assuming mailboxes might be where the key might be. I don't want to talk to you! Go away! I gotta find mailboxes before I pass out from all this drinking. Found it! And with that, we are at key. Number five. Sweet. Time to go see a kid, these kids' secret base. Where was that secret base now? More north. Excuse me. Coming through. Pardon me. Hey, buddy. What? You want to our secret base first? You got. We each keep. What? You got the five keys? Whoa, you're totally awesome. I'll let you in. Then the prophet will see you in a bit. And I'm going to beat that little prophet up because he gave me such a hard time in the future. And I don't want to go through that nonsense again. I might as well take out the source now while they're weak and little. Hey, get back here, Mr. Prophet. I'm drunk and I got a raging rage to deal with you with. <gasps> Look at all these pots. Look at all these pots, everybody. I'm gonna break them all. Yeah. Yeah. I'm breaking all your pots. Woohoo! Yeah. There you are. Quit running, kid. I got something to say to you. Oh, there's more pots. You're, I bet you're hiding one of these things. Trust me on it. Oh, you must be... F this door is closed. Oh, if only I could reach you. Uh, I mean, if maybe if I did this? Yeah, you better run. I'm coming for you, kid. Will you stop following me around? And who do you think you are going around breaking everything in our base? You can't prevent the great disaster from happening anyway. You'll never manage to get all the way here. Nee, 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 nee. Kid, I'm drunk. And when I'm drunk, I have a will. The will to catch your ass. Dang it. <laughs> hmm. If I... If I did a thing, I could stop that pipe from running up to the wall there. Actually, this actually reminds me of a certain puzzle in uh, Golden Sun. Why did I not hit? I think it was based. I think it was in the Mercury Tower, ex ex specifically. Okay, I'm gonna push that there. Why can I not hit this? That's stupid. But yeah, in the Mercury Tower, you had to push these pipes around to kind of activate water channels. Of course, why this is so hard, I won't know, but whatever. Oh, I see. No, actually, I don't see. Hmm. And the switch won't get hit, which is really pissing me off. Because in the prior games, 
well, actually not the prior games, the prior levels, if I just hit it with my wind ability, it would hit the switch. So this is kind of breaking the whole, you know, aspect of the game, letting me hit the switches. Hmm, you look like a cracked wall. Can I read you? Nope. So yeah, how do I activate you and get further in? Because, yeah. If you're not going to let me interact with the Switch in game, you're going to have to let me hit it somehow. And at the moment, you know, you're kind of breaking that for me, game. I can't freeze the stuff. <sighs> yeah, I'm getting a little pissed right now. Uh, I can break the wall back there? Who knows? Well... I don't know. Because, yeah, you're interesting mechanics to me I'm not totally ready for, and I'm not sure where to go from here. I can't push these, that's for sure. Wait, wait, wait. My brain fart is forming. I have idea. It's gonna work. Trust me, folks. That, yep, yeah, there we go. So we do that. Now when I go over here, I'm gonna push that pipe up. It will get blocked. Next thing is to push this one down. That will block this one when I push it back over. Like so. I'm going to push this one up. That will connect it to where I need it to go. And finally, since this pipe here is useless, I'll push this one up. I'll push this one over. Bam. I cake. Now the switch activates. The water fills up. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. There you go. Now oh, I took a little while. Sweet. Now I can probably push this out of the way because now that's filled up. I can go over here, and oh, I still can't get to you, buddy. What did they say about that? Ah, look what you did. You collected the five keys. You flooded our secret base. Water covers everything. And you shattered my pots into smithereens. You are the great destroyer. Oh, God, this is where it comes from. I was just a nuisance to you in your base. Ah, kid, again, I'm too drunk to deal with this shit right now. So that's how you became the Great Destroyer, Gilp? I guess we got worked up over nothing, but we still had to stop the Prophet. We ran into him in the future. He's clearly nuts. We must, he must be behind the Great Disaster. So Yuli, what do you say about this? You see those droplets hovering above the water, Gilp? Yeah. I think I can use my power to freeze them! Sorry, wrong voice. It's worth a shot, right? Whatever you say, Ice Lady. Ta-da! I told you those things were important way early in the game. Can I break this door? Nope. But I can't free this water. Ugh. Ah, oh, I gotta wait now. Come on. There we go. Damn, I didn't charge up enough. Ha ha. 
Hey! Who are you? What is this with all these people getting in our secret base today? You want to prevent the great disaster? Is that it? <sighs> you people. Yeah, I remember you demons. The great disaster! What disaster? Huh? You're the demon! You're a demon! Oh crap, how did their voices go? That's right, Smeagol voices. Hey, hey, you asked a question. So answer him. <laughs> so answer him. I... Don't eat me! I'll tell you everything. It was our plan, me and my friends. For the 50th anniversary, we are going to make a great disaster happen. It's their fault too. The adults, they punished us. No fireworks, they said. So we figured we could still light everything up. And boom. But that's it, I swear. You call that a great disaster? A great disaster is when your entire people is wiped out. It's when all you have is left is rage. And that will seek vengeance. You'll be patient. The real great disaster is coming. The war that will give you the taste of defeat and humiliation. The war that will save, avenge the crime and humans committed. We've collected all the energy from this place. Just a little more. Tiny bit more. Sure, who are the new guys? So you're the ones who are going to spark the great disaster. Well, we're the here to stop you. Oh, really? You think you can fight us when we are prepared to die for our cause? I'm not sure why these demons have such horrible voices, but because that's what I started with, that's what they're getting. I'm not frightened of, of danger. Great Destroyer, save me. We're stopping you here now. So we can protect the future. We'll see about that. Everybody, freeze! Who could it be? Oh god, secret agents. Groovy agents at that. <laughs> hey, where do they go? Behind us! It's an ambush! <laughs> oh god, they're idiots. I knew they were dangerous. They can't do anything against us, because we are. The Imperial Special Forces! Woohoo! You're under arrest. Great! Thanks to you, we'll be able to stop those demons. Demons? Nobody said anything about demons, did they? No. The suspects are a young man and a two young women. Humans. That's definitely them. Plum! Cherry! I think it's time we took our leave. God damn it. Mistaken identity and I have to deal with the authorities now. Ugh. Help! Quickly! We gotta stop them! Great Destroyer! I'll take care of the Special Forces. Thanks! Run! Whee! Thank you, kid. I guess you weren't too much of a dick. Until you get older, then you'll be a big dick. Uh, the best we can do for now is to go after those demons. Whatever you say, lady. Oh god, we're platforming again. You followed us? Go on ahead, I'll take care of them! Watch yourself. Okay, let's have us a little fun, shall we? Get back here. Oh god! It's Sonic the Hedgehog! If I saw the Hedgehog, actually, I, I can specifically remember what this is. If I think back correctly, this was uh, kind of the chase scene between uh, Metal Sonic and Sonic back in Sonic CD.
Woo, this game tough. Damn it! Oh, this is gonna be hard. Yeah. I'm gonna get you, buddy. Ow. God, concentrate. This is actually pretty fast paced right now. I'm gonna get ya. Damn it. Oof. Almost. You almost caught me there, buddy. I'm gonna get ya. Where'd you go this time? Aw, oh, damn it. I missed a jump. Aw, oh, damn it. So close. Actually, I don't know how close I was. I'm just assuming I was close. Damn it. I missed it again. This time, however... Whoosh! There we go, that's much better. I'm gonna get you, Mr. Demon Kid. Yeah, I got that jump that time. Get back here! I gotta kick your ass! Oh, damn it, the crates fell on me. It's okay, we hit the save point, that's good. But man, we're really jumping genres here, by the way. I mean, last time it was just straight up RPG style, but we, now we're jumping between Street Fighter, RPG, saw the Hedgehog, platformers. Okay, how the fuck am I supposed to get past this? Because, yeah, the game is forcing me forward, and I can't jump over it. Or can I? No, I can't. I'm fucking screwed if I can't jump over this. Unless I do this? Okay, there we go. Ah, oh, fucking A. Oh, come on! I should have been able to jump over there just fine. There we go. God damn it. That's so unfair. Like, I have to kill those crates ahead of time. And usually it's with a charge attack. Otherwise, they just crush me. And that's completely unfair. Oh, come on! That little box is blocking me. That's bull. Okay, I'm out of that nightmare, thankfully. Get back here, Cherry! Come on, I gotta beat you. Fuck. Come on! Ugh. All right, whatever. Fucking great. There we go. What? I died because you didn't load fast enough? Fuck you. Again, game. Quit pushing me forward so much. I wouldn't have to deal with these falling crates on me if you didn't just force this mechanic of me f going forward. Ah! Again, I'm too drunk to deal with this nonsense.
Well, fucking A. Yeah, like, yeah, like, you know, at least in the Sonic games, I was able to, to kind of decide my, my route. Even if I messed up, I could still take an alternate path. This one's actually punishing me for taking alternate paths. And that's kind of bullshit right now. There we go. We hit a save point, at least. I'm gonna get you, kid. Or adult. I don't know how old you are. Oh god, it's a Mega Man battle. We've gone from Sonic to Mega Man now. Let's see if I'm correct. Yep, it's right Mega Man. Now, now that we're done warming up, let's get down to business. Mega Man! Ow! You're just as cheap as Mega Man. God damn it. Okay. I hate how my charge attack goes away when I get hit. That's kind of bullshit. There we go. Wow, that charge attack did not do anything. Oh my god, this is going to be so hard. Okay, please tell me I can freeze you. Come on, Cherry, you're going down. Oh, come on. Your attacks can't all do the same damage. Small ones and big ones. I'll accept the big one doing 20 damage, but... Yeah, small ones can't do that much. But at least I think your weakness is ice. Oh, come on! Again, between the speed of my jump and your attacks, it seems quite unfair. Alright, I guess I have to take this to patient route then. Again! My jump is so fucking slow! Ugh. Again, I get they're trying to go for the Mega Man mechanic, but it's so in the enemy's favor versus mine. And again, like, shit like that... that that one attack goes up and shoots that is bull because again none of the attacks were like that prior to getting him there was nothing for me to learn how to deal with that mechanism i just have to deal with the fact that i'm gonna die constantly which is bad i mean i have infinite lives for sure but again Oh no, let me concentrate, guys. Ugh. We're making progress, but uh, it's getting so annoying. Wow! Oh, that's stupid. Again! You can't throw attacks at me that literally f go where I'm gonna dodge. 
The point of those attacks is to give me a, a bubbles so which I can actually avoid them win. Not only that, but I have zero iframes for the most part. See, like that. Ugh. And again, I hate the fact that every attack does the same damage. Like, I can deal with the big attacks doing a lot of damage, but touching me, the small attacks doing the same amount, that's really unfair. Given the small ones are harder to dodge than the big ones. Again! Oh my god. That shotgun attack. Alright, I'm going to assume ahead when to the point where I beat this guy, because it's getting really annoying now. Okay, finally! Oh my god, Cherry, you... You're a headache and a half. I'm sorry, Plum. You're very you're strong. Perhaps you could stop him, protect him from his own madness. Plum and I were not strong enough. Help him! He is all alone! <laughs> Thunk. You know, you're not quite dead. I could probably just car carry you out of here, you know? Anyways, I'm gonna fall down the hole now. And gravity. The other two got away. We have to find them. They're probably long gone, but we have to find them if we want to stop this great disaster. I still can't believe it. If what you say is true, what could have caused such an explosion? It would require an enormous amount of energy. I don't know. Got any ideas, Gilp? <gasps> yes. Seriously? Well then, I'm counting on you. We probably won't find any clues in Genova. We better look elsewhere. Yeah, let's do that. So we're gonna open this chest up. Find some greed goop. And we're going to walk out of town, hopefully. Yep. The old period of jail isn't... Yeah. Oh, man. That was a headache and a half, folks. Um, so, yeah, that's it for me tonight. We'll continue Evil Land tomorrow and see where else this crazy story is going to lead us. And, boy, this is much more in debt than uh, the first Evil Land was. I mean, holy cow. I mean, the whole progression of technology thing is not as apparent, but the fact that it's having us jump around from future te technology to past technology, I mean, it's much less linear, but it's better used this way. I don't know, my brain is broken right now. That's all the thoughts I have. So, folks, I'll see you again when the gears start turning. Later.